there, Rider Flex Nation. Steve Urban here with more career advice and job interviewing tips for you. And as a quick reminder, if you enjoy our podcast, please remember to subscribe to our channel and like the episodes. And today I want to talk about whether or not you actually show up in a search, okay? Search, what I mean by that is when a recruiter searches for certain criteria, let's say they're putting in sales, uh, Denver, um, VP, and maybe they're even putting in furniture because there's uh, several different ways they search. A lot of times people use something called Boolean search. Uh, if you don't know what Boolean search is, I recommend you Google that and, and do some research on it because learning how Boolean search works will help you craft your LinkedIn profile and your resume with certain words so that recruiters can find you. But also on LinkedIn, recruiters have what they call a a recruiter seat, and there's a bunch of uh, very powerful search criteria and categories they can put in. And if your profile or resume, uh, if they're missing keywords, you're not going to come up in a search. Just last week, I had uh, somebody contact me and say, hey, I'm, I'm, I'm looking for, you know, a new job. I, I'm, I'm ready to kind of start my, my process. Do you have any tips for me? The very first thing I did was looked up their LinkedIn profile, and I said, well, what is it you want to do? They told me, hey, I'd like to be in, in sales. I want to be in this particular industry, et cetera, et cetera. And I said, okay, well, let's just do a test. And I searched for her in with with my recruiter seat on LinkedIn, and I put in the criteria of what she wanted to end up being or doing, and she didn't come up anywhere in the search. Um, and it was the same thing when I did a Boolean search for her as well. And it, so she was trying to maneuver herself into a different industry and a little bit different type of position. Um, she wanted to, you know, make sure her resume was coming up towards the top and searches and, and we needed to do a bunch of things to tweak that profile for her. So here's what I recommend you do. Learn how Boolean search works and then test it. Go in and do a Boolean search for all the different buzzwords for your particular, uh, for for what you're looking for. Put, put a search into Boolean for the area you live in and, and see if, your profile or your LinkedIn profile pops up to the top in a, in a search. And if it doesn't, then you know you have work to do, okay? You can also, if you know recruiters, if you have relationships with recruiters, which I, I highly recommend you do, you should ask them to do a search for your type of profile and see whether or not you come up towards the top. And if you don't, you need to do some things to change some buzzwords and keywords within your profile and within your resume. So the summary of this speech is test it. Just test it. Do it. Do a Boolean search. Have a recruiter do a search and see if your profile comes up anywhere uh, towards the top uh, when, when they're testing things. And that'll tell you whether or not you have work to do. All right, my friend. And there is your Rider Flex tip of the day. We truly hope you find our material helpful and entertaining. And while our podcast can be heard across most platforms, including iTunes, Google Play, Spotify, YouTube, and SoundCloud, you can become a supporter of this podcast by visiting our show on the platform Anchor FM. That's anchor.fm slash riderflex. You can also send us your questions or suggested topics for future episodes to the email address podcast at riderflex.com. Or drop us a voicemail at 888-964-5876, extension 710. Visit riderflex.com to learn more about us. Thanks so much for listening, folks, and have a great day.